uh, doing this pods recall, which is the passenger seat here, the occupancy detection system. It's a recall. So hopefully I can get uh, a good view for you to see. And it pays uh, anywhere between 0.9 and 1.3 hours labor to do. So as for the recall that we have to do, you have to strip the seat down, change, this is called a seat occupancy sensor, this mat, and the seat itself, you take it apart from the frame, you then have to change this wiring harness here.
basic setting on the uh, parts that I just put in. Now I have to connect the Volkswagen scan tool to the car so that um, I can perform this operation. But I can't just log in. I have uh, some uh, verification to do. Now, I have to check my phone for a special number. <laughs> Normally, I would have to enter an RO number, which is funny because to do that, yes. So you, logically you would think you click on here, which is where you enter, and then a window would pop up and then you would, you know, put the arrow number and that's it. But you click on here and then own order number, then put number in, accept, and you think that would be it, but no. You have to select the ordering number and then it tells you there's no concerns about the order and then it will scan the card. So this is how long it takes. Well, pretty quick on this one, but to uh, do a scan of the vehicle modules. basic setting, so I'm going to go in Diagnostic Case Tool Systems, Functions, there we go, and let's attach the plan, now I can perform the plan, and I don't know why they give you useless information that Just like if it's not okay, tell me. Why do you have to give me this? Like, who cares? Yeah, I know. That's why I'm here. clears faults and then it will request me to send a diagnostic log which is weird because the whole thing is done online I don't know why I need a separate log but like they can see everything I'm doing all my selections Now the job is finished. 